There's a lot of cruise mistakes that are out there, but if there's one cruise mistake that too many people are still making all the time, it's booking their cruise on the Cruise Line website. Hey everyone, it's Matt from Cruise Blog, and today I've just got to be real with you guys and talk about the biggest problem everybody still makes, which is booking a cruise directly with the Cruise Line, especially online or even calling it in for that matter. You know, in this day and age of travel here in 2022, we've all been empowered and told that it's best to book things on your own, right? If you remember the old days of travel, you know, you had to go through third parties to book things, and then the internet opened up so many possibilities, including being able to book directly with the supplier, in this case, the cruise line, and it would save you money. We saw this with airlines, hotels, car rentals, and you know what? That was absolutely true for those markets. But for the cruise market, it's doing yourself a disservice by booking your cruise directly on your own. Now you might be saying, well, why is that? It's pretty easy. I just go to the website, put my information, bada bing, bada boom. I've watched your videos, read your articles. I know everything I should know about a cruise. I'm ready for it. The problem is the reason why you shouldn't be booking cruises on your own is because it's not about the booking. Of course, anybody can book a cruise. It's actually really easy. But when it comes to cruise travel, there are nuances that go well beyond the actual booking process. And this is where the value of using a good travel agent really comes to bear. You know, when we're talking about not booking a cruise online, I'm talking about instead booking through a travel agent. From the day you book until the day you sail, and sometimes even afterwards, there can be issues, questions, or concerns. Certainly, if anything's taught us over the last two years, anything, it's that there can be changes in policy and it can be confusing and there's a lot of different factors you should do. So instead, you really should be booking your cruise through a travel agent who's knowledgeable with the nuances of cruising and can help you. It's kind of like having a lawyer. If you go to court, you can represent yourself in court, certainly, but having a lawyer makes it a lot easier for you because they know the law, they know the ins and outs, and they know what mistakes to avoid, right? Same is true for travel agents when it comes to booking a cruise. But the difference between a lawyer and a travel agent is a lawyer costs you a lot of money. Travel agents should cost you absolutely nothing extra for their services. The travel agents are paid a commission by the cruise line, and the price is absolutely the same whether you book your cruise directly through the cruise line or through a travel agent. So this won't cost you anything extra, but you get all the added service that comes with it. Now, I mentioned earlier you read all the articles on Cruise Blog and you watched all our videos, which is great, but odds are you probably didn't, right? And you may have questions. And a good travel agent can really key you in on which itinerary to pick, which ship is better for your family or not, what type of cabin makes sense before. It can be overwhelming to try to figure it all out, and a good travel agent can help you out with that. In addition, cruise fares can really vary. Now, while I mentioned the price is the same, whether you book it online or through a travel agent, there is a difference in that travel agents may have access to discounts that you're not thinking of, and that can obviously save you a lot of money. The most common issue with booking on your own for me is simply that you're going to be running into possible issues of things you're not aware of. It's things you don't know you don't know, right? And making a mistake in things like what type of cabin, the type of itinerary, or even the ship choice can really ruin your cruise experience because there are such things as, quote, bad cabins or bad dining times, right? So you want to avoid those. And again, a good travel agent can help you out with that. With cruises, you typically pay also a deposit up front and then the rest of it later on, or you can make payments in between. But the nice thing about a travel agent is they can ensure you don't miss any due dates and, of course, not you know jeopardize your entire cruise vacation. Remember, you may be a DIY type when booking airlines and hotels, and that's great, but booking a cruise is way more complex. And if anything, if you learn anything from our videos here, it's that there's a lot that goes into it. And you want to make sure that you're focusing on the things you want to focus on, the fun things like planning awesome shore excursions and things you want to do on board, rather than having to worry about, oh gosh, did I book the wrong room on the wrong deck in the wrong spot? Again, a good travel agent who specializes in cruises can really help you learn a few tips and avoid common rookie mistakes. If saving you time and headaches isn't enough for you, they can also sometimes get better deals on cruises for you. In addition to their expertise, a good travel agent may have negotiated cruise space at lower rates with the cruise line, which of course can save you money. The agent may also have first access to sale prices because travel agents get notified of changes before a lot of other people, so that can really benefit you as well. So you've heard of me say all this. Okay, you're ready to book a cruise through a travel agent. How do you find a good travel agent? My personal recommendation is word of mouth. You want to talk to people who have a good travel agent who say, yes, this person really helped me out and then go with them. There's a ton, a ton, a ton of travel agencies that are out there. So your number one stop is going to be your friends and family to ask them exactly what kind of travel agents they use 
and if they like them, and if they recommend them as well. Certainly, we have a sponsor here at Cruise.blog in the form of MEI Travel, and they're fantastic, and I've used them for many, many years. But what you want to do with any travel agent is make sure that they're going to work with you. Most travel agents today work from home. The days of going into an office are all but gone. There are a few brick-and-mortar agencies that are out there, so I don't want to pretend they don't exist. But you shouldn't limit yourself to any agencies that you can drive to. The entire cruise planning process can all be done online, and it's actually easier and faster to do that and saves less gas, so even better. So it's really important to look at you know, first-hand recommendations from friends and family. And even then, I would go one step further and talk to them about your concerns. What are you worried about? What type of issues are you concerned about? Let them know about that so they can help you and make sure they put your mind at ease, that you feel more confident that they're not only going to be helpful, but also an expert in the field. You can ask them about their cruising habits and how often they cruise and which type of lines they typically sail on and any experience working with first-timers that can assure you you've made the right decision. So in short, step away from the cruise line website, find a good cruise travel agent that can guide you through choosing your cabin, dining times, deposits, and final payment, and make sure you're ready for an amazing cruise. Hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below what you look for in a good travel agent. What characteristics really make a good travel agent stand out from the pack? I'd love to read those down there below. Also, while you're down there, please like our video and subscribe to our channel. It really does help us out. If you can subscribe, we're trying to get to a thousand subscribers here, so it would really make a big difference. This has been Matt from cruise.blog, and we'll talk again real soon.